So do you guys rent in the city or? Yes, I rent. I own. Because I'm fearful. I, I, you know, every now and then I'll look on, I'm a small business owner, so I work from home a lot. And I'll look for two bedrooms. So I'm like, oh, maybe I can have an office. And I'm like, not in this lifetime am I paying that much rent. It's crazy. And we kept um, having our landlords want to sell. So we both mm -hmm. individually and together as a couple with my partner had to move three times because landlords were selling and all of that. So you're just going, I have no control. I have no this. And then at the time, um, I had inherited some money, and so there's an opportunity to maybe buy. Well, I had my eyes on the prize for a while, and I looked at this dilapidated house. Dilapidated? Is that the right word? Yeah, that yeah. Is. And I was like calling every family member and like, it. can I pull it together to make this happen? And then, so I did. I, I every now and then I have times where I'm like, I've just got to make this happen. And then I'm like, this is stressing me out too much, and it's going to be. I'm not going to be able to travel at all. I'm not going to be able to go out for dinner if I own this property. So you know things that are supposed yeah. to be so called affordable aren't really or for yeah. the space even what they're building now is not reasonable you know you see what new builds are you're going that's yeah. not really a bedroom yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh that's a big closet yeah. totally. you know so i hope it gets addressed more and it just i don't know yeah <laughs>